I'm Blaine Russell. Today we're going to be talking about how to optimize your local Google SEO. When it comes to local SEO, the main objective for most businesses is to be found at the top of Google Maps, as that's where the majority of the clicks gravitate toward. The map display is impossible to miss, and it visually dominates the top of the search engine results when Google determines the search contains local intent. To be found in Google Maps, your business must have a Google My Business profile, otherwise known as GMB. If you're a new business or just haven't claimed your listing yet, you should do so now. But simply claiming it and verifying ownership isn't enough. You need to optimize it and continue to be active in order to reap the full benefits. Take advantage of every character space available. If Google gives you an opportunity to include a piece of information about your business, include it. This is a source for local business data that Google uses for its local search algorithm. In addition to claiming and completing your profile, here are some tips that will help you leverage its full potential. First, you should optimize your description for your specific location. You're allowed up to 750 characters for your description, which is not a lot. It's important to take full advantage of this space and optimize it for your location. Google uses the address of your business in relation to the IP address of the individual performing the search. If your business serves cities and towns beyond your location's address, you'll want to cleverly work those variations into your description. Next, you can geotag the photos to increase local exposure. When you upload images to your Google My Business profile, you should take advantage of the geotagging option. If you pay attention to the local search results, you'll notice that Google has been showing more images, even for local results and including business information alongside them. Google does this because visual content has become so popular. With many businesses not adapting quickly, it gives you an opportunity to be the first in your market to take advantage of the strategy. Make it a habit of posting images often as it gives your feed a constant source of new content. Another thing to do is enable the Google My Business SMS contact option. This is a feature that many don't take advantage of. If you don't enable the SMS contact option, you'll miss out on potential inbound inquiries. People today use text messaging as a primary communication method as is more convenient than making a phone call. Enabling this on your Google My Business profile allows you to connect a mobile device to receiving text and reply to them. Listings that have this option enabled will often draw more attention simply due to convenience factor. Lastly, your Google My Business profile is home to your online reviews. You should focus on your Google reviews to improve your click-through rate and rankings. These help your business in two ways. First, they make your business more appealing as people are naturally attracted to the business with more and higher reviews. Second, Google's local SEO algorithm takes reviews into account. Make a valiant effort to secure reviews from your past customers and put a system in place to encourage reviews from all your clients moving forward. When you focus on delivering the highest quality product or service, you'll find that your customers will be more than happy to fill out a review. There's no one-size-fits-all strategy that works for every business, but you can at least use these SEO strategies to increase your rankings in Google. If you implement these techniques in a way that works best for your business, you will see an improvement in the amount of traffic your business gets.